Hey guys, how's it going? I'm so excited for today's video because as you know, technology is rapidly changing and improving our lives in so many ways. Thank you so much to Snapdragon for partnering with me on this video. So last year in 2023, I went to the Snapdragon Summit where they announced the X Elite chip and they announced all the things that you were gonna be able to do and how it was gonna be such a game changer for the PC industry. And guess what? Now we have it right here in front of me in the flesh in this tiny, tiny little Dell XPS 13. And I can't wait to show you guys what I've been doing with it. What excites me the most about this is yes, obviously we're gonna get the best in class performance and we now have the on-device AI, but the battery life, the battery life is something to talk about. So not only is this the first next gen AI XPS, but it is also their thinnest yet. This does have up to a 13.4 inch 3K plus OLED display. And yes, this is thin and it's also lightweight. This actually only weighs 2.6 pounds. So these devices are made to tackle those heavy workflows. Obviously I am a video creator, so I am doing a lot of video editing and I shoot everything in 4K. So a lot of those 4K files take a lot to process and to render and to upload. And it's great now having the performance in such a small, tiny laptop that can handle it. Now I don't want to lie to you guys. The majority the majority of my days are pretty boring. Being a creator is the best job, but not every day is exciting. The majority of my days, I am just hanging out around my house. In the morning, I'm having my coffee, I'm answering my emails, and when I'm not creating, I'm usually just doing a lot of planning, or I'm doing emails or video calls. And the one thing that I love the most about having the built-in AI is the Windows Studio effects. So with the Windows Studio effects, I love that you're able to turn on these features to help give you kind of like the best video experience. So during those calls, if you have this feature turned on, you're able to have the automatic lighting to make sure your face stays lit. The eye contact feature will kind of keep your eyes at the camera so that you're not all over the place. And we also have the auto framing. So if you're like me and you move around a lot, the camera will kind of track you. And of course, we've got all types of cool, fun backgrounds and things like that to kind of make your video calls special. But one of the coolest features is the live captions. The live captions adds the ability to translate any live or even pre-recorded audio from 44 languages. If you actually stop to think about about it, it's pretty impressive that all of this is happening right there, built into your PC, and it's happening almost instantly, which is super impressive. So the Snapdragon X Elite chip paired with the Qualcomm Orion CPU, as well as the Qualcomm Adreno GPU and the NPU is what makes this so powerful, but also gives us that multi-day battery life. So with the 12 core CPU, it's going to take those heavy workflows, but it's going to handle this with extreme responsiveness. So you don't even have to think about it. It's just gonna happen. So yes, I do a lot of video editing where I'm going to need that extreme power, but also sometimes I just like to chill and I just like to hang out and watch shows or even maybe play games. And the great thing about this is with the Qualcomm Adreno GPU, you're going to get these stunning graphics and you're going to have this super immersive entertainment experience. And since the Snapdragon X Elite chip is made for this, that's how you're getting away with the low battery consumption and the multi-day battery life. But now let's talk about the on-device AI. One of my favorite things is now having the ability to just push this little co-pilot button right here. With the push of a button right there, Copilot is ready to help me. I recently been dealing with an ankle injury and I've been going to the doctors and all of that when I realized it was more than a sprain. Turns out it's broken, but I was getting x-rays and I was getting MRIs and obviously you get the impressions first when you know somebody reads it, they break their impressions. And I'm not a doctor and the words that they said were not everyday words. So I took what they said, I typed it into Copilot, and I said, can you please explain this to me in everyday terms? But being able to use that technology and get an instant answer instead of me basically, you know, spending nine years to become a doctor to read that was actually fascinating. Now, if only AI can fix my broken ankle, that would be great. So that's just one of the examples of how AI has helped me. One of my favorite things when I was younger was messing around in Windows Paint. There's now a built-in feature called Co-Creator. So with Co-Creator, you can create AI-generated images using a combination of words, but also your own artistic ability. You can even kind of just start to draw and it will help you out in the side and you can kind of choose your style, choose your design. I can't wait to have my niece try this because she loves doodling and she loves coloring and drawing. And sometimes she gets a little frustrated when it doesn't turn out how, you know, her mind pictures it. Also, I also get super frustrated because I'm many things and I'm not an artist. So this is just a fun way to, you know, be creative, but also kind of have a little bit of help and inspiration if you need it. 
So as a creator or just a person, I'm obviously using a lot of apps and I'm using a lot of things on a day-to-day -day basis. And the best part about Copilot Plus PCs is they now offer more native windows on Snapdragon experiences than ever before. So whether you're using the Microsoft 365 apps like Teams, PowerPoint, Outlook, Word, but it also doesn't stop there if you're using Chrome, Spotify, Zoom, WhatsApp, Blender, Affinity Suite, DaVinci Resolve, and there's so many more that run natively on Windows on Snapdragon, they're gonna give you the best performance. And it's just the beginning because there's many more apps to Come, which I cannot wait. I'm not the type of person who can sit still. So I move from bed to couch, to outside, to my dining room, to the floor. I am moving all around and I just, I cannot be tethered to the wall or to an outlet to charge. So that's why I'm very grateful for the long battery life, especially on a plane. I travel back and forth from the West Coast to the East Coast a lot. And sometimes there are not outlets on the plane. And now I don't necessarily have to worry because I know I will be able to survive a five hour flight. So that's kind of how I've been using the Snapdragon X Elite chip, which seems really lame compared to a really cool thing that I recently got to go to. I'll make this short. I recently got to go to Washington to go to the Gorge to see an Odessa concert where Odessa partnered with Snapdragon as well as Uprox to make this really cool art installation. And everything that they did to make it happen all happened on a Dell XPS 13 with the Snapdragon X Elite chip. So I know what this device is capable of, so I really need to get creative and and try some more cool stuff. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. Thank you to Snapdragon again for sponsoring this video. If you want to learn more, check out the link in the description and I will see you guys again soon for a new video.